Welcome to The London Perspective. I'm your host, Stefan. Today we're going to be talking about the one and only Murray Bartlett. From his iconic roles in Sex and the City and Welcome to Chippendales, to his upcoming role in HBO's The Last of Us, Murray has made a name for himself in the entertainment industry. But did you know he's also an Emmy Award winner? That's right, Murray took home the award for Outstanding Supporting Actor in September 2022. But one thing that's always been a mystery is his personal life, specifically who he's in a relationship with. Well, I've got some answers for you. As an actor in the public eye, Murray has always been very private about his personal life. However, in one of his acceptance speeches, he briefly revealed that he is in a relationship. When he won his Emmy, Murray thanked his partner in his speech, saying, To my partner, Matt, thank you for being my sanctuary. But that's all we knew, until an interview with Mr. Porter in January 2023. Murray revealed that he and Matt have been together for at least three years and that they have a rescue border collie named Bo. He also mentioned that they have very different personalities and that it can be challenging at times. But it's not just Murray's relationship that's had fans talking, it's also his iconic roles. In season four of Sex and the City, he made his American television debut when he and Carrie went out to gay bars. And who could forget his role as Armand, the horny hotel manager on The White Lotus? But Murray's not just known for his gay roles, he's also played Nick DeNoyer, the creator of male striptease routines in Welcome to Chippendales. And coming up next, he'll be appearing in The Last of Us on HBO, where he'll be paired with Nick Offerman's character in the post-apocalyptic zombies drama. In his interview with Mr. Porter, Murray also discussed his early career decision to come out as gay. He said, As a younger actor I thought about being out or not, but I just never felt like lying about myself was an option. And while he thinks he may have missed out on some parts because people knew I was gay, he has no regrets. I've had incredible opportunities to play incredible gay roles. He is truly an inspiration for the LGBTQ plus community. So there you have it folks, a little bit more insight into the personal life of Murray Bartlett. But that's not all we have for you today on The London Perspective. Next week, we'll be discussing the new film adaptation of The Last of Us and how it compares to the video game. And don't forget to tune in to HBO on January to catch Murray's new role. And as always, if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to reach out to us on social media. We love hearing from our listeners and building a sense of community among us. Thanks for listening, and we'll see you next time on The London Perspective.